So, Lou, you're Mason's agent now. Kate signed his contract over to me. Is that legal? It's all in accordance with the contract that Mason signed with Kate. <laughs> I guess Mason should have read that contract a little better, huh? I'm so glad to hear you say that, guy. Mason didn't really get a puppy, did he? You were Kate's boyfriend, right? Well, yeah, sort of. I mean, yeah, we did stuff together. Restaurants, movie theaters? Well, until we get kicked out. Okay, that's cleared things up then. How would you like me to initiate our first sexual contact? I can attempt any of these maneuvers listed here, or we are contractually free to attempt new types of Congress. What? Right here, where it says, I, guy, whatever, being of sound mind and really hot body, that's your signature, isn't it? Yeah, but... Okay, so I had my eye on this one here. It looks satisfying. And that much paraffin doesn't chafe? Now hold on. Is that contract binding? It's just something Kate and I did for, well, you know, fun. And you also had it notarized for fun? Kate kind of had a thing for 24-hour postal places. So you see, this contract is binding. That means you are my boyfriend. We can either consummate this contract here and now, or take care of it later. But I don't like to leave legal matters like these dangling. Do it later. I'm sorry, Mason, you don't really get a say. I think if it involves you desecrating my brand new sofa, I get a say. Read your contract again. Oh, really? I didn't see that and all future sofas in there. <laughs> Wait, I don't feel right about this. You don't? Not really. Sorry, I didn't realize. You seemed pretty open to it. Mixed signals, you know. Okay. We can rip this contract up. We can? Sure. See? Done. Oh, thanks. Um, I gotta get back to, uh... Literally my firstborn. Mason, we really should come up with some kind of code word in case you actually do get a puppy. Hey, let's rip up my contract too. Sure, you can do that. I can? If it makes you feel better. <laughs> of course, it doesn't actually void it. Wouldn't be a very good contract if it did. But you were feeling better, weren't you? For a brief moment. I'm going to be the best agent you ever had. That's what bothers me. And my red hot love is going to make a guy want to change religions. Ah, I didn't hear you. Can you say that stuff somewhere else? Guy has a religion, right? I'm not talking about this with you. 